Hello everyone, and welcome back to another video. Today we'll just see some development on the Easter event that just recently got leaked. Let's get started. Some time ago they showed us this official creature, and was not released at Valentine's event which leaves us with the thought it might be probably released at the Easter event. Ibechi might also be released with the Easter event as well, but we are not sure of that so don't assure it. The DEVS have not given us images of Maya's development, and it's reasonable since there's still a month to wait until Easter comes. Today they also leak this. In this text, they say the general concept of this event, how it works, and how the creatures will be introduced this being the currency we'll need to get them. They are thinking of scrapping the intense PvP idea and introducing a more co-op friendly way to earn mushrooms and progress in the event faster. They'll divide the previous Easter creatures into a store and a gacha, Kiiki, Fagu, and Verdant Warden alongside a new creature will come. Although both of the store and gacha will use a new currency which will need eggs, you won't need to worry about hoarding mushrooms for these creatures since you will just be able to play the event, fight the bosses and get some extra eggs via some smaller tasks now about boss battles and co-op specifics. I will just tell you all some of the points that catch my eyes, but if you wish just pause the video to read it all. All the players within the battle do not deal damage to each other. Regardless of what creature you play the damage percent will be the same, you could be a Yulopi and still deal the same damage as Alexis. The boss will release 3 waves, the more people there are the harder the waves get. The event will last 3 weeks, and each week will introduce a new creature on Friday of that week. That is all. Thank you for staying. See you.